Gospel is powerful when it's shared. As we share the gospel through media at Iran Alive, we see thousands of Iranian Muslims come to Christ every month. These people come from all levels of society. That includes educated and uneducated, powerful and powerless, people who are young and people who are old. Professor Hamid is one of those people who started watching our programs and came to Christ. He's a professor at a major university in Iran, and this is what he says. I've been watching your TV programs for a long time. I like your logical and unbiased way of teaching the Bible. Last year, after watching one of your programs, I prayed with you to, to have Christ in my life. My heart and soul were transformed immediately. I felt a joy and peace in my life that I had never felt before. Anger left my heart, and a love for people replaced it. Then he shares that I felt so scared to share my faith with others. I thought if I do that, I may lose my job and maybe even arrested, tortured, and even killed. Then he says, that frustrated me. On one hand, I wanted to share my faith. On the other hand, I was afraid. Then he says, a few months ago, when I was having lunch with people in my department, one of them turned to me and said, Professor Hamid, have you become a Christian? Fear overtook me, and I felt a cold sweat cover me. But I controlled my fear and confidently declared, no, I'm a Muslim. That evening, when I went home, I started crying because I felt I had denied my Lord Jesus Christ and I have failed him. I hated myself because of that. However, a couple of months later, again at lunchtime, my colleagues confronted me, but more directly this time. Professor Hamid, we know that you are a Christian. You can no longer deny it. I replied, why do you say that? One spoke on behalf of the others and said, because we have been observing you. You are a changed person the last few months. You no longer gossip. You no longer get involved in office politics. You're no longer angry. You're so peaceful and always treat others with respect and love. You cannot deny it. You must have become a Christian. It was then that I got courage to tell them that the love of Christ expressed in Jesus has changed my life. I told them, if you want to research as I have done what Jesus teaches about God's love, then watch Iran Alive's broadcast. My friends, this story is not just about a professor coming to Christ. It shows how Iranians view Christ and Christianity. You can see that how they know that when somebody comes to Christ, their lives are changed and transformed for better. They have a positive view of Christ and Christianity. And that's why they're so open to the message of the gospel. I believe 16 years of Christian broadcasting has had a part in changing their minds towards Christ and Christianity. Iranians know that Christ changes lives. Gospel is powerful, but when it's shared, would you partner with us to share the gospel with Iranians who are so open to Christ, to the message of the gospel? May I ask you to prayerfully consider partnering with us to take the gospel to every home in Iran. I assure you, every month, the gospel is bringing thousands of people to Christ. This is an open heaven in Iran. Together we can see Iran and the Middle East transformed for the gospel.